This week, the Washington Commanders and the Baltimore Ravens got together for a joint practice in preparation for Monday night's preseason game. Now, for the Commanders, they like what they saw overall in building and moving forward, starting with the quarterback position and the offensive line. Now, Coach Rivera said that overall he's pleased with what he saw. And talking to some of the players on both sides of the ball, they like what they saw, but they realize that they still have a lot of work yet to be done. The main thing is I'm just more confident in the offense and I'm way more comfortable out there calling the plays and knowing what we're trying to accomplish with the play that we're calling. Um, and I feel like I'm in a really good place mentally with what EV's trying to do and we're on the same page. And it's just a lot fun. It's a lot more fun going out there now. And I'm kind of just playing instinctive at this point. I'm going back to, you know, how I, I'm just out there playing football at this point. I mean, there's not really much thinking to go on. I'm um, just feel I'm very comfortable with the offense. Uh, talk to me about these last two days out here. What can you take away from today, these last two days? We can take away that, you know, that we're a physical team and we're really good technique wise, but we got to be better if we want to win. We want to win on Monday and go in and take that and move it into the season and become the best team we can. In terms of helping Sam Howell out, Charles Leno said that this offensive line must do their part. And he goes on to say that this offensive line, they're not backing down from anyone. Let me take care of my part as being a tackle. Um, I can just do a better job for him to help him, you know, uh, improve. I think we mentioned well uh, today, last couple of days was a phys physical days, and I feel like we ain't backing down from nobody. Um, and I just feel like we're just still growing that bond together. On day two of the Commanders and the Ravens joint practice, Washington's first team defense, well, they outshined the first team Ravens offense and quarterback Lamar Jackson, who was off target most of the day, found it difficult to find open receivers. Oh, God. Hey, Daron, how do you all think that you all did overall in what you were trying to accomplish today? Uh, we just look at it as another practice, man. We got we got some things that we did good and some things that we can work on. But uh, I feel like everybody just came out here with uh, the right mindset. Hey, KJ, no are you pleased with what you all were able to do these last two days on defense overall? Um, I wouldn't say please because that's, that's close to satisfied, right? I, I think we did some good things for sure. Uh, started a little slow yesterday, but um, definitely you know, had a, I think we had a really good day today. Um, but definitely room for improvement on you know all all strides of the board, right? So I um, think we moved ourselves in the right direction, um, but still got a ways to go. What can you take away about your performance these last two days? Uh, I think I think I got better each day. Uh, to be honest with you, I, um, definitely still you know a lot of room and improvement for for me as well. But um, just trying to take the coaching and the tips I'm getting from the older guys has um, been a, a big uh, a big task on my on my shoulders. So uh, I think I've been intentional with that and you know trying to put it on film. Hey Kendall, uh, two days in the books. How would you describe these last two days defensively? Did you like what you saw out there? Yeah, it was fun, man. I think ultimately just being able to go against some somebody different. Uh, you've been going against your guys for so long, so to go against different guys, other different skill sets to, to prepare yourself. And uh, I think it was a good day. We had fun. We came out here, competed, um, you know, put some good good film out there to, to learn from, um, made some mistakes out there that we can learn from. So over, overall, I felt like it was a good week. What stood out most about, you know, these last two days defensively? I mean, what the positives? that some of the younger guys, the Emmanuel Forbes, and some of the things that you saw, what they did out here. I think just competing, man. Um, you know, DB is one of those positions to where you go through highs and lows. It's a it's a position where you got to have a lot of respect for what you're doing in the field, and um, you got to have the utmost confidence in your ability. So just for, for the guys to come out and compete, um, guys make plays, you make plays, and you just keep on keep on lining up with that confidence and. To see young guys consistently step up and just make plays um, from the ones, twos, threes, it was it was big. Good to see. Hey, Kwan, what are some big takeaways from these last two days for you and for this team overall? Uh, just you know we can come out and compete with anybody. You know, just being the most physical team on the field, no matter what, special teams, defense, offense, and uh, just being able to fly around and make plays. Talk about yourself as far as what did you learn about yourself even more so going up against another team like the Ravens? Uh, honestly, I just realized I can hang with anybody and I'm just going to continue to grow and just learn our defense. Do you like where this defense is going overall in preparation for that Monday night preseason game against the Ravens again? Yeah, I feel like we sh it should be you know, a pretty good game and we should get out there.